Hi everyone, I hope you are all safe and healthy with your family and friends. In this video we are going to learn about 11th Standard Accountancy Chapter 10 Depreciation Accounting Exercise Sum Number 30. Let's see the transaction. <coughs> the furniture costing rupees 5000 was purchased on 1-1-2016. The installation charges being 1000 rupees. The furniture is to be depreciated at 10% per annum on the diminishing balance method. Cost journal entries for the first two years. So what they given? They have given purchased asset dated on 1-1-2016 and installation charges 1000 rupees at the rate of depreciation 10 percentage. We have to find the depreciation. We have to find cost journal entries for the first two years on diminishing balance method. That means return down method. Okay. So the format of the journal entry is date particular sale of debit rupees credit rupees. Okay. So when you uh, when did you purchase machinery, furniture? That means when did you purchase asset? 11 2016. What's the journal entry for purchasing purchased asset, furniture account at or to bank account? Okay. Six thousand rupees entered bought furniture. And what's the closing accounting period? Thirty first to twelve every year okay so we take 2016 on purchasing year okay purchasing period purchased period what's the general entry for the depreciation provided depreciation depreciation account data to furniture account listen here carefully we have to provide uh, give the depreciation for providing depreciation at the end of the accounting period okay What's the period for the depreciation accounting period? At the end of the accounting period. So what they given here? 31st, 12 on every year. Okay. For every year. So we have to calculate 31st December 2016. First year. Okay. The first year depreciation is 600 rupees. What's the percentage of depreciation? 10 percentage. So we have to calculate 10 percent depreciation with original value that is 00, 0 cancelled, 00, 0 cancelled, 600 rupees. This is the first year depreciation what we written here. Okay. So we next we have to transfer the depreciation account into the profit and loss account. We have to take the same period 31st December 2016 for first year depreciation. Okay. So, to transfer the depreciation into profit and loss account, what is the general entry? Profit and loss account data 600 rupees to depreciation account 600. So, listen here, where is depreciation here? It is on debited. Now, when we transfer it to profit and loss account, the depreciation account is to be credited. Okay. Okay. Let us take the second year depreciation general entry. Dated on two, uh, 31st December 2017. Depreciation account data to furniture account. Depreciation provided. How much rupees? Six, uh, 540 rupees. Listen, for first year depreciation, we have to subtract it. First year depreciation 600 rupees from the original cost. We will get 5400. So, we have calculated diminishing method. Return down method. Okay. So, we have to take after depreciation value. Okay, that is 5400. So, we have to find the second year depreciation from this value at the rate of 10 percentage depreciation value 00, zero cancel 00, zero cancel. How much rupees? 540 rupees. So, this is the second year depreciation what we get. Okay, now we have to transfer the depreciation into the profit and loss account on the same date. Okay. So, profit and loss account data to depreciation account 540 rupees, 540 rupees. Depreciation account is transferred into the profit and loss account. Do you have any doubt? Please comment it on the comment box. Thank you. Take care.